short video test up the disaster anyway pushing forward with the counterweight for the tower i have a 50 foot tower by Merrill Wright, one and a half inch tubing so my astro engineer brother-in-law figured out the counterweight was eight thousand and something or something like that i forgot the figures but anyway i needed a 28 by 28 square which i told him that's the size i wanted to go square nothing bigger and then how deep which ended up being five feet this one is actually six feet deep and then i'm going to put the stone at the bottom below the actual six foot it's a little bit more it's like a few inches i'm going to put the three quarter uh blue stone down there for drainage of water anything that comes down to the base but that's it uh it's about all man this will give me a counter force for any larger wind turbine in the future that i put on that is for that and then this as you've seen before is the base that i fabricated uh a while back and then i got it hot dip galvanized uh up at a factory near us in uh, south amboy and then uh after that i made my template i put that underneath that one and i did that the black stuff is the uh rubberized spray just to keep the wood from warping or rotting around there and then of course i sprayed the hole underneath with the rubber eyes because it's going to be sitting on a wet concrete so and then all the rungs are marked so when i put them in the ground so i know like hey if i want to pointing the rungs to the inside the j hooks to the inside they'll all be facing inward to that and that's it so i'm going to order some concrete on monday and hopefully tuesday wednesday i'll pour 1.2 yards of concrete in that cavity and uh, be done with it and then uh, 30 days has to lapse for the thing to cure and at least I think it's somewhere recommended. I got to call my mason buddy again. I think a week or so, so it's not green to put before I mount anything. You know, banging on anything. But I don't plan on it. Those rods are set pretty close to tolerance in that wood, so hopefully it goes on smoothly. And uh, Murphy's Law doesn't ride my back on that. All right, that's it for now. Concrete's next.